Agar and Gelmar, Wex and Urzen, Stig and Black Lauren. Ironborn warriors will cry out our names as they leap onto the shores of Seaguard and Faircastle. Aye. Mothers will name their sons for us. Aye. Girls will think of us with their lovers inside them. Aye. And whoever kills that fucking orb blower will stand in bronze above the shores of Pike. What is dead may never die. What is dead may never die. Ah! Thought he'd never shut up. It was a good speech. Didn't want to interrupt. I invoke Sumai. I will vouch for her, her people and her dragons, in accordance with the law. Be it on your head. Welcome to Karth, my lady. I think they're out looking for you. Yes. I think they'll find you. Yes. You're brave. Stupid, but brave. We start again at first light, get some sleep. Stop moving. I'm just trying to get comfortable. Stop it. You're still moving. Was I? No, I didn't notice that time. Did you pull a knife on me in the night? What's the matter? It can't be the first time you press your bone against a woman's ass. Commander, welcome. Stop. Stop! Your captain commands you to stop! Where are we headed, Captain? The Stony Shore. To raid their villages. There'll be spoils in it for you and women, if you do your jobs well. And who decides if we've done our jobs well? I do. Your captain. <laughs> I have been reaving and raping since before you left Balon's balls, Captain. 
Don't reckon I've got much use for your ideas on how to do it. Don't reckon I've got much use for a captain at all. I'm thinking I could do the job of captain real well myself. All I need is a ship. You wouldn't know where I could find myself a ship now, would you? You can do that. Take the ship, head out on your own, and I will hunt you down, drag you back here in chains, and hang you for a traitor. Stop! <laughs> we yield! <laughs> Congratulations on your first command. Thank you. Kind of you to come see me off. Oh, I'm not here for you. I was just on my way to Red Harbor. I've got 30 ships. There's nowhere to put them here. Too narrow. Better get out there. Wouldn't want her to set sail without you. That would never happen. My crew would wait on deck for a year if I asked them to. This lot, though. Enjoy the stony shore. Dracarys. Dracarys. <laughs> He'll be able to feed himself from now on. Let him sleep, Doria. Yes, Khaleesi. Why am I here? To help me plan the defense of King's Landing. <laughs> Stennis will be here any day. And one of these explains how to beat him. An history of the great seizures of Westeros by Archmaster Shevelethem. Shevelethesh. Kshvaltish. I'd swap all your books for a few good archers. Ah, the great sieges of Westeros. Thrilling subject. Shame Archmaester Shavayothan wasn't a better writer. What about you, anyway? I thought they were after you. Why? Did you kill someone, or is it just because you're a girl? I'm not a girl. Yes, you are. Do you think I'm as stupid as the rest of them? Stupider. The Night's Watch doesn't take girls. Everyone knows that. Yeah, that's true. You're still a girl. I am not. Yeah, well, pull your cock out and take a piss, then. I don't need to take a piss. <laughs> Mommy and Hot Pie can't know. No one can know. Well, they won't. Not from me. My name's not Ari. It's Arya of House Stark. Yaron is taking me home to Winterfell. Who's your father? The Hand, the traitor. He was never a traitor. Joffrey is a liar. So you're a highborn then, you're a lady. No, I mean, yes, my mother was a lady and my sister, yeah, but, but... you were a lord's daughter and you lived in a castle and you... But all that about Cox, I should never have said... And I've been pissing in front of you and everything. I, sh I should be calling you Milady. Do not call me Milady. As Milady commands. Well, that was unladylike. My lord. Fresh fruit. My Stannis lord. has more infantry, more ships, more horses. What do we have? Is that mind of yours you keep going on about? Well, I've never actually been able to kill people with it. Good thing. I'd be out of a job. What about your father? He hasn't sent a raven in weeks. He's very busy. 
Being repeatedly humiliated by Rob Stark is time-consuming. He won't be able to hold the city against Stannis, not the way Joffrey is planning on holding it. Corruption! Yes! We are swollen, bloated, foul. Brother fornicates with sister in the bed of kings. Are we surprised when the fruit of their incest is rotten? Yes! yes a rotten king! It's hard to argue with his assessment. Well, after what he did to your birthday present. The king is a lost cause. It's the rest of us I'm worried about now. The dancing king prancing down his bloodstained halls to the tune of a twisted demon monk. <laughs> You have to admire his imagination. He's talking about you. What? Demon monkey? People think you're pulling the king's strings. They blame you for the city's ills. Blame me? Trying to save them. You don't need to convince me. Demon monkey. Your visits are too few, cousin. Her Grace the Queen Regent commands you to release Grand Meister Pycelle. Is your warrant? So it is. Will you take a cup with me? I find that mulled wine helps me sleep. I am here at Her Grace's behest, not to drink with you, imp. If my sister was so concerned for Pycelle, I would have thought she'd come herself. Instead, she sends you. What am I to make of that? I don't care what you make of it, so long as you release your prisoner immediately. And you've received these instructions directly from Cersei? As I've said several times. And you've waited this long to deliver the information? When the Queen Regent gives me a command, I carry it out without delay. Cersei must have great trust in you, allowing you into her chamber during the hour of the wolf. The Queen Regent has a great many responsibilities. She often works from dusk till dawn. She must be very glad to have you helping her from dusk till dawn. Ah, lavender oil. She always loved lavender oil, even as a girl. I am a knight. An anointed knight, yes. Tell me, did Cersei have you knighted before or after she took you into her bed? What? Nothing to say? No more warnings for me, sir? You will withdraw these filthy accusations! Have you ever given any thought to what King Joffrey will have to say when he finds out you've been bedding his mother? It's not my fault! Did she take you against your will? Can you not defend yourself, knight? Your own father, Lord Tywin, when I was named the King's squire, he told me to obey her in everything! Did he tell you to fuck her, too? I only meant... I did as I was bid. Hated I... every moment of it. Is that what you'll have me believe? A high place in court, knighthood, my sister's legs spreading open for you at night. Oh, yes, it must have been terrible. Wait here. His grace will want to hear this. Mercy! Mercy, my lord, I beg Save it for Joffrey. He loves a good grovel. My lord, it was your sister's bidding. The queen! I'll leave the city at once, I swear. No, I think not. My lord? You heard me. My father told you to obey my sister. Obey her. Stay close to her side. Keep her trust. Pleasure her whenever she requires. No one ever need know. As long as you keep faith with me. I want to know what Cersei is doing. Where she goes. Who she sees. What they talk of. Everything. And you will tell me. Yes, my lord, I will. I swear it as you command. Oh, rise, rise. Let us drink to our understanding. Oh, you don't have a cup. Oh, well. Smile, cousin. My sister is a beautiful woman, and it's all for the good of the realm. Go back and tell her that I beg her forgiveness, that I want no more conflict between us, and that henceforth I shall do nothing without her consent. But her demands? Oh, I'll give her myself. You will? Yes, I'll release him in the morning. Cersei can keep him as a pet if she wants, but I will not have him on the council. I could swear that I had not harmed a single hair on his head, but that would not, strictly speaking, be true. Traitors! 
all their heads! Oh, you blind, bloody fool! You can't insult me! We've had vicious kings, and we've had idiot kings, but I don't know if we've ever been cursed with a vicious idiot for you. You can't! I can, I am! They attacked me! They threw a cow pie at you, so you decide to kill them all! They're starving, you fool! All because of a war you started! You're talking to a king! Ah! And now I've struck a king! Did my hand fall from my wrist? <laughs>